that this is one of the first real rail lines that's, that's fully using positive train control. 50 people die every year due to rail incidents. 50 people every year. And most people don't know that, most people don't think about it. But everybody who works for the Rail Operation Safety Branch has at least one incident in their work where they've had to account for the death of somebody who was trespassing or was caught in a vehicle on a track or who ran to try to get in front of a, a train. Increasingly, um, this is it's common that you'll find younger people especially who have earbuds on and don't hear the train coming up behind them. And so 63 um, uh, grade level crossings is, is a risk in the community. I'll point to one crossing, which is, is, I think has really caused us to think long and hard about grade crossings, the Jennings Crossing, which is right next to the school, and increases the potential for these kinds of, of injuries and deaths. With, uh, with SMART, there's going to be a substantial increase in traffic, especially during commuting hours, and we are concerned that um, you know, people will be not really adjusted to the fact that these trains are going to be so much more frequent. 50 people die every year due to rail incidents. 50 people every year. And most people don't know that, most people don't think about it.